Welcome back to No Man's Sky, everybody. Elon Paul here, and uh, we're doing the world's playthrough on this particular episode. We are going to do something a little different. Once again, as you saw in the last episode, we did uh, the Deep Sea one, right? Uh, Dreams of the Deep. Well, this episode, we're going to finish out one of the other secondary missions and get it out of the way. And that episode is Under a Rebel Star. So that's what we're doing on this episode. It shouldn't be very long. This is actually a pretty short episode as well. So let's go ahead and get started, shall we? First things first, we need to go into hyperspace because it's in a different system. So we're going to go to this system down here, which happens to also, I believe, be a pirate system. And we're going to head there now. And this will be the last of the secondary missions I'm going to be doing. We're going to go back to the main missions after this. There will be one more interim episode in between that will be um, upgrading everything. Um, I need to get a better multi-tool. I like the multi-tool I have, but it's time to get a nice one. Uh, hopefully, preferably A or possibly S-class multi-tool. So we'll be looking for that. And really just going through and upgrading everything, getting all the weapons, getting all the stuff like that. But we're going to take this opportunity to fight some pirates, apparently, first. Okay, and rather than just knock them out of the sky and get rid of them, I'm going to go ahead and take care of them. This guy really went far. One down. Again, I don't have like the infra knife on me, so we're using the standard weapons from the actual sentinel ship. Hmm, they're actually doing some damage to him, and I just literally ran right into him. Fabulous. Oi, okay. Spinning around. I'm trying not to get uh ships behind him in case there's a stray shot. He's coming right at me. But, again, we got the ship right behind him, so I'm trying to avoid. Okay, we're done. I think that's it, right? Yep, that's it, but for some weird reason... We're not exiting the battle. Maybe we did have a stray shot hit someone. Okay. Let's hit the space station real quick. That way we can get out of this battle mode. Normally you get the possibility of getting yourself a freighter, but I guess they didn't particularly care for me. This is not a pirate system. Look at that. It's a regular system. How oh, interesting. Okay, let's head out. Ooh, we got a we had a exotic on the landing pad there. I just missed it. Oh well, it is what it is. Alright, so we're heading that way. On our way, scan the system, let's see what we got here. Ooh, it's a dissonant planet too. How interesting. One we've never been to. This could create other opportunities in this particular episode, so we're going to keep an eye on that. Alright, here we go. Very interesting planet. Approximate coordinates, so we want to take a look. See if we can find anything. I think we ought to scan. See if we find any buildings or anything like that. Alright, we do have it still selected. Okay. Let's go ahead and drop it down. Because with this particular type of landscape, it's hard to find anything. Alright, let's take a look. It is that way. Right about that way. So let's go ahead and take a little quick run over that way. You know we're going to grab that. 
Just because? Okay, so it's over that way more. Get around this stuff. Oops. Now it's this way. I think it's over there by that damaged machinery. What do you think? We can always pull our ship in. Nope, it's definitely not by that damaged machinery, but it's in this general direction. There we go. And you know what I forgot to do? I, I do have another damaged uh, ship in my inventory that I need to sell. I keep forgetting about that, but it is what it is. All right, let's check it out. There is nothing here but the distress beacon of a crashed starship. There is no sign of life. Download the logs. I attempt to salvage what I can from the log of the crashed ship, sifting through the diagnostic data. They appear to have been the victim of a sudden, overwhelming assault. Cockpit recording. Among the endless data, the countless warnings and errors triggered by the flames that consumed the ship, there is a fragment of a recording, a window, into the starship's final moments. Don't ask me to do that. All I got is the word down. Suddenly, the voice changes. The muffled shouts of the pilot fade away, cut through by words that ring out in a clear and powerful tone. Zzz, resist the red. Zzz, we shall cut out its crimson eye. The end of the message is accompanied by a clear navigation si navigational signal. A rendezvous point. But for who? Take the rendezvous beacon. Zzz, death to the scarlet. Zzz, tyrant. Whoops. Hi there. Looks like we're getting into a little bit of a fight here. Didn't expect that. Now you understand my need to get a better weapon. You can stop them from healing, by the way, the corrupted ones, by shooting them. Shoot the one that started doing the healing, and you can take them out. Alright. And they're multiplying. Problem is, if we do this... I don't know. I have to think about it. Uh, nice ship. A-class again. I'm going to go ahead and claim it. I'm going to go ahead and build a metal plate and a hermetic seal... I'm going to repair it real quick so it's out of my mind and out of my heart. There we go. Done. Let's get around the outside of this. I'm just going to jump in on my ship over here. I do want to go through with this because... Um, it'll give me the opportunity to find maybe another new ship. best way to fight these guys, because you're going to get some spiders involved and stuff, stay on top of your ship. They're still going to be able to get you, but they won't be able to get underneath you. See what I mean? Right there. Do I have a plasma launcher? Yes, I do. Take out your hired guns over there. And then take out the spider, because these guys will heal, heal the spider faster than we can uh, take them out. See what I mean? Oops. Oh, we need to pick up a barrel. shield back. Hopefully nothing got damaged. Okay. We gotta take him out before the swarm multiplies real quick.
Got him. All right, so little guys are out there now. Back up to the top of the ship. Now these guys are just as vulnerable to these things. Got a big guy over there. See, so you learn this trick in the other one, but this this plasma launcher is just not quite powerful enough to really subsist, subs, uh, sustain me. It looks like we got another one over there, and we're running low on plasma. Interesting. Got to pay attention to the power. Since there's no other people to heal him, we're going to go ahead and take him out the old-fashioned way. Because he can't fire at us from the distance, yet. What is that? I don't know what that is. I'm going to find out in just a moment. Multiplying. I want them in a different direction rather than the hill. Let's get them over there. Alright, good. I can handle them. Okay, good. Someone's hunting me. Okay, these guys. Whoa, hello. Is that everybody? Nope, we still got two more. Oh, a bunch more. Everybody? Maybe? There's still one more out there. You see by the red arrow there? He's over there someplace. Oh, it's a big guy. That's why. See if I can get a better beat on him. Right there. Get a different angle on him. I know I'm detected. Completely, and then we're going to take them out the hard way. There we go. Hopefully that's it. It is. Good. So we're going to find ourselves a ship here. That'll be very, very handy. So two birds of one stone, if you will. This is something I've been wanting to do for a little while now. So looks like we got ourselves a ship. All right. Good deal. So that was fun. up our resources real quick because that would be the smart way to go. Uh, 
There's a couple more right here. Okay. Any more? Any more? I don't think so. All right, so... Damage machinery. Okay. So what do we got? We got a rendezvous beacon. We're going to go ahead and take care of that. We ended up with five crystallized hearts. That is a really, really good uh, find right there, guys. So we're in really good shape here. Anything got damaged on my person? Doesn't look like it. And multi-tool looks okay. We are running low on plasma. We're going to have to get some more, but that's okay. We're in good shape. All right. Let's check out this ship and see what we found. Oh, wrong way. How far away is it? An hour away. You guys have time, right? Yeah, neither do I. Let's check it out. Obviously, it's on the other side of the planet from where I'm at. Why it would show me one closer, but that is one of the RNGs of the game that we have to deal with, so it is what it is. All right, let's see what we got. Let's see what kind of ship they're dealing with here. Ooh, what have we here? Is that a sweep wing? Ooh, check that out. Oh my, what have we here? The B class. It's better than what I got. Let's go ahead and grab everything. What's the back look like? I'm curious. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, good. And the landing? I uh, still got the landing skids, but this is going to be a pretty looking ship. Alright, I think we might have found our next ship. Oh, uh, yeah, I'll take that. Yeah, don't want to go through that right now. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's go ahead and do this. Real quick here. We'll keep going with this ship for now, and in between episodes, I will go ahead and... Uh, really? Huh. I am glad to have that on board my... My, uh... Multi-tool. Alright, um, where was I? Starship. Let me just check here real quick. Is there anything else in here? No? Okay, good. Uh, so we have the Hylian Brain... Hyaline. I say Hylian. That's... You know as well as I do, that's old Zelda terminology. We'll leave that alone. Let's go ahead and get this taken care of real quick. And I'm probably going to make uh, copies of this as well. That would be the smart way to go. You may have noticed in my inventory I now have a personal refiner. A backpack refiner, if you will. All right. I've installed that. It's ready to go. I should have... Where's my personal refiner? Did I leave it somewhere? I might have left it someplace. That would be hilarious. Maybe it's in the ship. Okay. We're not going to go through all this. We already know what it says. It's the same thing every single time. Okay, we got a new highlight. Good. Harmonic brain, my bad. Okay. Do we have... Okay. Do we have another one? We do. Okay. Well, let's do this real quick. I want to make another copy of this. Um, find it. There it is. Because it's good to have a copy. I want to make sure we get it as close as possible. There we go. Can we make one more? We have the ability to make one more, but I'm not going to worry about it. Three brains. Good. Because, you know, we all know three brains are better than one. All right, on our way. That's for down the road a ways. I'm going to remember this planet because those ships are wonderful, and I want to find myself an S-Class on this planet if I can find it. I really don't want to have to spend the nanites on that, that's for sure. Okay, here we go. It's a pretty ship. 
I'm going to take it for a test spin. You know why. Or at least get a picture of it. See what it looks like. Okay. And it's done. It's already got two supercharged slots on board as well. That's really good. Compare it to the ship I've got, and I can just claim it. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Let's just climb in and take a look at it. Very nice. Oh, well, that's pretty. How about we get a picture, shall we? Let's get some light on this thing. And pull back. So I don't know what the exact coloring is, but this looks really nice. Uh, we are definitely going to be transferring everything over in between episodes. So for now, I'm going to go ahead and land this sucker. Oh boy, I do like the way it looks. That's a really nice ship. Um, quick, there's the, the coordinates for this planet. I have it as well. It is around the 21 to 22 minute mark. Very nice. We are coming back here, definitely. All right. Let's move on with our ep our, our episode here. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's what we were doing. Okay. And we will come back for more ships like that. So we don't want that. We want this, the tri pilot transponder. Wow, it's doing a pullback even though I'm in my ship. That's a first. Got helicopters flying over our house. Very interesting. All right, looks like we're heading that way. Okay, so this rendezvous, as you notice, it's not centered on a planet. It's in the middle of space. So let's check it out and see what we got. What are we doing? Anti-gravity needs to be recharged. I don't know how much longer I'm keeping the ship, but we're going to need it for this episode. I'm going to use some tritium to charge that back up for now. And... here. Okay. So, what do we do here, right? There we go. So you're going to be fighting some pirates. Take out these two canisters on either side. There's one there. And there should be one on the other side over here. Pirates are not going to like you for it, but you're just going to call more in if you don't do it now. And you're getting some nice stuff out of it. Be careful, these guys might shoot some phase beams at you when you get really close, especially when their shields are down. Okay, these guys are kind of tough. There's four of them, huh? Whoa, okay. This guy's all over the map. Shield's recharging already. Oi. I don't suppose you guys would mind hand, uh, like standing still for a little while. Be easier. Got him. Shields are getting a little low. I'm gonna beef up the shields on the new ship, too, while we're at it, so we don't have to deal with this kind of nonsense. Got him. Should be it. Alright. That should be it. Now what? We got a trip pirate transponder out of it. Suspicious tech. Uh, should be over here, actually. There we go. As a protection. Why not? the shield variety, so it should go over here. Eh, it's not bad. It's okay. Alright, so what's next? Scan the navigation point. Let's go ahead and do that. And we have an unknown frequency coming. Lie upon lie upon. That's what our dashboard says. Lie upon lie upon lie. You wish to follow us, to seize your freedom, to reject the grand lies of the atlas. We shall see if you are worthy of the voice of freedom. Challenge them. I hear only static in reply. A faint laugh echoing through the noise. Okay. So. 
Looks like we're heading elsewhere now. Heading over here this time. Alright. Back to the same planet. Boy, am I going to remember this planet. Can't wait to get that ship all decorated and up and running. That'll be really cool. I think by the time you're getting this one... The expedition for Beachhead should be over. Or at the last day or so. Keep that in mind. So, we'll be going into a new ex uh, Redux expedition soon. Uh, follow the voice of freedom. Okay. Everything just vanished. I see there's a building right below us. What could it be that building over there? Hmm. One right here seems to be abandoned. And I think it's... Yeah. Alright, let's check this one because it actually has a landing pad. And we can use that. Oh, I think it's... Oh, we found the right place. Good deal. Let's head in. Okay. Terminal. Oh, while we're here. Grab stuff. Always want to grab stuff while you're here. Alright, what do we get? Glorious Survivor. Welcome. The path to liberty is... Shall be our own masters. Psst. Rid of the Clemson illusion. A sky for the strong. It's broadcast finished. The terminal begins printing a secure pass. An invitation, it seems, to meet the voice, this voice of freedom. Accept the invitation. Okay. Follow the voice of freedom. On our way. Should we talk to our fellow over here? What does he have for us? Uh, pulls out a vault hidden in the machines pile high with starship upgrade modules. Uh, wants to know if we want to buy anything, basically. We don't want to use units. Um, we don't want to threaten to report. Let's offer metal. You're a ferrite. Ship deal from Nas. Deal is done. Good deal. So we get a nice C-class hyperdrive module or whatever. Okay. It was something anyway. Alright, in we go. And off we go. So what is our next... Let's see here. Oh, we got to deploy it. Okay. It's in our inventory of our person. There it is. Our inventory is getting nuts. We're going to have to start cleaning it out again. Okay, where to? Doing the pullback again, even while I'm in my ship. I love that. Okay, fly into space, access the galaxy map. Okay, new system. Ooh. One I haven't been to, but you notice that the little uh, icon for the skeleton is there, the, the pirate icon. So this is a pirate system we're heading towards this time. Let's see what we end up with. So we got a little bonus sentinel battle there, bonus ship that we're going to be end up getting. I'm going to see if I can't find, like I said, at least an A-class one of that, possibly an S-class, so I'll be doing a little playing on the side to try to find it. And we'll sell off all the other ships that we had. Yep, definitely pirate system. Yep, outlaw station. Just head for the station. All right. Here we are. Okay, so we're here. Alright, it's telling us all about the outlaw stations. You can feel free to read that later. Uh, explore the station. Okay, let's explore it. So what we want to do, it will tell us here in just a moment. So I'll make sure it didn't expect us to go outside the station to do anything. Locate the voice of freedom. There we go. Speak to those aboard. All right, so we just want to talk to the different people that are here, the NPCs. Welcome, glorious survivor. Here, there are no Gek, no Corvax, no Viking. Here we speak 
one tongue. Here we are free. They ask about the voice of freedom. Only the strong deserve to sing with the glorious voice of freedom. We do not permit the weak to find us. Okay, so that's one. Let's talk to another one. Welcome, new face. To find us is to be chosen. To find us is to be free. There are those who would deny us our freedom, new face. Those who would sacrifice everything to appease the sentinels. But the voice keeps us free. Okay, so that's two. Let's talk to the little Corvax guy over here. Comparison with the Viking. He's tiny. The Crimson Fiend erupts minds across the galaxy. No more will we be will we prostrate ourselves before its all-seeing red eye. To speak with the voice of freedom is to roar back against the crimson void. It is glory itself. Okay. Uh, do we have any Gek around? Kind of cool to talk to a Gek as well. Yeah, this one over here, but I think he's part of the ship. Let's find out, shall we? You are one of us now, new face. Nope, he's not. You are bonded to us. You are free. The voice is not one voice, but many. It is our voice. It is your voice. You sing with our choir now. And we just got our Shroud of Freedom. Now we need to explore the station, so we're going to check everything out. Start with the Salvage Dealer. Whoops, I just bought a Cyclone mo Cyclotron module. I hate that. Uh, it gets you uh, <laughs> and surprises you, unfortunately. Uh, Boltcaster module, maybe? Infra knife? That's nice. Let's buy both of those, because I'm going to be putting that in my new ship, definitely. Shield is for exosuit. Uh, I need one for my ship. I don't see one, so we'll hold off on that. Okay. Why not a movement module? I'll just get one, just because. All right, what else we got? So we got the guy up the stairs here. This is our mission guy who gives us bounties and stuff. So you can do any of these to get stuff. Sentinel bow. It, you get some really cool things too, including nanites and stuff like that. So keep that in mind. Good place to get things. This is our contraband agent. Um, picking up a bunch of the stuff like counterfeit circuits, okay, but the suspicious packets and arms and tech good stuff to get this is how you can make a lot of nanites so just basically opening these up and then selling what you get out of them back to the like the upgrades and stuff selling them back and then jumping to another pirate station doing the same thing by the time you go through about three or four stations you can come back to the original one and make a lot of nanites that way check out my nanite video i'll probably highlight it at the end and you guys can check that out but you get other stuff here other weird things as well so okay and who else you have a appearance modifier, so we can put our Shroud of Freedom, in case you're wondering what that looks like. Oh, this is our upgrade. Pardon me. This is our exosuit upgrade. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'll go ahead and just do it. All right. Um, this is our appearance modifier. We'll take a look at it. I'm not going to put the Shroud of Freedom on, but... Oh, the Lost Bathosphere. I finally got it. This is the one that it should be. But it gave me a deep sea helmet instead. How interesting. Okay, we're going to have to look into that later. And it's blue. Very good. So, we'll come back to the deep sea helmet and leave it there. Here's the Shroud of Freedom and what it looks like. That does look kind of cool. Maybe I'll leave it. Yeah, you know what? I think I'm going to leave it. Nope, we don't want to do that. Nope. Yeah, I like that a little better. Let's do that. Okay. Okay. You notice my appearance has changed a little bit as well. All right, so we want to talk to this terminal up here. Life support systems, commercial monitoring disabled. Station defense is primed for freedom. Atlas Aeron surveillance uplink rejected. Request the voice of freedom. Glorious survivor, the promised star will be yours. Glass, 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 glass. And that's it. Anything else to check out? You do have a scrap dealer over here if you want to visit them. Uh, since the now familiar trading pheromone as I approach the Gek, but there's something else mixed in. I feel an overwhelming sense of gray, a murky fog at winding itself, at winding itself through my mind. That doesn't make any sense. Opportunity, profit for all, yes. No restrictions on what can be sold, I think. Uh, let's take a look. Purchase all scrap. So they got other stuff in here you can get with tainted metal, what you get from the uh, ships, as well as other things you can pick up on the way. So, 
Anyway, moving on. And this is your weapon terminal. But there's no weapon upgrade terminal. Keep that in mind. Nothing special there. Okay. So, I think... Is that it? Leave the system. Okay, we just have to leave. There is also a ship thing over here. You know what? While we're here, let's do this real quick. Uh, pull that one in. Let me check it real quick. See if it's the one I think it is. It is. I have nothing I can just get from it. What's my inventory look like? I don't have room for anything is what's going on here. Uh, let me pull my other ship back in real fast. That's my ship. Okay. Let's move some stuff from our inventory on our person into there. Um, can we install that? Let me see. 108. It's nowhere near as good as some of these. Hmm. Okay. So, not a great run. Starship. 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 We need to make room. This, I think, I'm just... It's not even worth keeping. Get rid of it. Uh, I don't know why I bought that, but I'll sell it later. Wow, it's another upgrade I can use. Son of a gun. Okay, well, we're running out of room, though. Paralysis mortar can go over here. Put you over here. Make it a little more powerful. Yep, doesn't really seem to make a difference. 6410. 6433. Okay, all right. Well, that's that's going to work out okay. Let me try something real quick. Nope, same thing. But I'll do that anyway. Okay, good. Anyway, moving on. I need a new new one. You know that. Uh, let's see. What else do we have to get rid of out of our inventory? Okay. That should give us enough room, I think. Right? Okay. Let's go ahead and pull in the other ship. And we're going to scrap it. That one. Okay. Uh, salvage analysis. And no, I'm not going to part it out. Even if it doesn't, if it told me it could. We're getting a lot of money for it, so that's good. And what ship is popping into its place? Let's find out. Okay, looks like our radiant pillar. Let's switch ships one more time. And get rid of the other one. Oh. Nope, there it is. This is the one. And this one, if I'm not mistaken, also didn't have any things. Oh, it does have one. Okay. There. Okay, had one. Let's go ahead into here and salvage it. Again, scrap. I'm only getting 2.5, but still it's 2.5 million I didn't have before. And now we can sell those items. My radiant pillar keeps popping in. I'm going to go ahead and switch it out with my other ship. This one. Okay, good. We're back to normal. And no pilots are landing, so I'm going to go ahead and just destroy the economy. Because we need to get rid of some things out of my inventory to get the money that we are promised. Uh, let's see. we got one storage augmentation, by the way. We'll hang on to that. Because I'm going to make duplicates of that later. Rest indium. Uh, nano cables, some atomic regulators. Okay, that should do it. Looks like that's all of it. Okay, good. So we got a little more money. Okay, we're all set. So the only thing we need to do here is we just need to leave the station, or almost leave it, right? Station flight path monitoring alert. Exit clearance pending. Zzz, the voice of freedom would not pit the at permit the Atlas silence. New face carries our voice. You must hide your trail. Take this document. Disrupt the traffic records at a station core. Your voice will be free in the darkness. We're going to accept the task. And we got a forged passport, right? So, time for us to leave. So the only thing we need to do now is we need to leave this system and go someplace else. So where am I going to go? I think we're going to go here, which is our main system that we have everything at. Or is it here? I think it's up here. That's where our main uh, main office is, I guess. 
I don't remember now. That's sad. Let's go. We just need to go to a space station. Now, the station, the, the, the station authorities may try to stop us. We'll see what happens here. Let's see, let's see. Yep, this is the system. <laughs> Alright. What we're probably going to do is we'll go to the other system that I think, or that looks like our system, and uh, dismantle a couple things, just so it doesn't get confused in the future. Okay. So normally... We would go to the trade terminal and sell it because it's worth quite a bit, right? There it is. 680000 but instead we're going to do something else with it. What we need to do is go to the main terminal in the back. And it's upstairs, isn't it? Yes, it is. I forgot about that. Here we go. Okay, so life support system stable, commercial monitoring, everything's functional, right? And forged passport is what we want to do. And that should do it. We just gotta wait. And there it is. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, that should end the episode. I'm waiting for it to catch up. It didn't seem to take for some reason. Maybe I needed to go someplace specific. Is this my ship? This is not my ship. It did not register. Okay, so we're going to go back over there. Actually, we can't... No, we can't get there from here. So we'll have to... I was going to use the... Uh, teleporter to get there. We're going to go back to the station. Because apparently... There we go. Apparently, it's going to have to take... It's going to take me to a specific station that I need to do this at. So, follow the path. Don't go back to your own system. So we just learned something. We're into one way it won't work, right? Okay. Um, I apologize. It looks like it did complete out and didn't tell us. All right. So what we're going to do, we're going to do something just a little bit different here. We're going to use their teleporter to go back to my base, and we'll end the episode there. So apparently it uh, ended the mission with no indication that it was complete. Kind of uneventful ending of the mission, if you will. Okay. My bases. There we go. Master base. On our way. And he waved goodbye. That's hilarious. <laughs> that was great. All right. So this ends our mission, folks. We're going to go ahead and call it here as soon as we get back. Almost there. I promise. Yep, any time now. Don't want to get lost in the network, right? Okay, we're back. All right, good deal. So that should take care of all of this. So I want to thank you all for watching today, and I hope you enjoyed this episode under a rebel... Uh, I almost want to say under a rebel cause, but... Basically, uh, getting the Rebel mission taken care of, and it's out of our inventory as well. So next time, we're going to do... I th I'm trying to decide whether I'm going to do... Um, 
I'm, I'm not going to do any of these secondary missions. There's nothing left to do here. We're going to continue on with 16 by 16. But will I just spend the next mission going about, uh, the next episode going about and upgrading everything, or should I do it in between? Um, that's a decision for another time. Maybe I'll bring it up in one of my live streams and see what everybody has to say about it. So uh, if the next episode may be just me upgrading things, getting a new multi-tool, uh, getting my new ship, things like that, uh, I'd like to get the ship and the multi-tool in between. So the more I think about it, the more I talk about it out loud, that's what I'm going to do. So we'll do it between episodes, and the next one will be the continuation of 1616, the main storyline, and we'll go from there. Folks, I want to thank you all very much for watching again. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons. We'll see you in the next episode. Take care, everybody.